Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. Um, so we're going to do a sink strainer pour. And I'm doing this on, this is a wooden round. And I spray painted it with uh, black primer and paint in one. And it's sitting on top of <laughs> a canvas to catch the paint that comes off. So I figured this will be a two for one painting. Um, and I'm gonna do kind of like darker colors for this one. Obviously you can see the black background. And this is a pretty small round. Um, honestly, I don't remember how long across. I'll look at it in a second. But it's, uh, it does have one inch deep sides and I am painting the canvas below it too. So, yeah. And I'm going dark to light. So this is a, a kind of bronze metallic color. These are all different paints in here, guys. Um, so some Artist Loft Flow Acrylics. Um, there's some Liquitex Basics. It's kind of, some of these colors are a big mixture of different colors. And here we go with some orange. And we'll do some gold. Oops. Some yellow. And some white. Okay. So this is definitely enough to cover this round, it should be, and hopefully, I may need a little more paint to cover the canvas, but I'll worry about that when I get there. So I'm going to put it as centered as I can, and here we go. So this is definitely going to come out on the darker side. So that white I added at the end, so not too much of it will actually stay in there. I guess I'm incidentally doing fall colors again, although I didn't totally intend that. Okay, so we're going to let this sit here, and we're going to let it do its thing. It's looking really cool already. And then we'll come back and finish it off. I'm going to let it play and speed this up. All right, awesome. I'm going to go ahead and move this aside to dry. And then I'll do the canvas underneath. Okay, woo! So this is definitely not enough paint to cover this canvas. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and add some more to my cup. I figure I'll pretty much do the same colors here. And I'm just gonna flip cup this here. So I think I'll also kind of hit up some of the edges with some extra black. All right, here we go. Okay, well that definitely came out interesting, that's for sure. Not bad, not bad. I like the colors. Okay. 
So I realized I never did a close-up and also I thought I would just show you guys how these dried. So here is the wooden round that I did um, the strainer on. I realized that this is very rough. I should have probably sanded it first, but it came out really cool. And then this is the painting, which I actually am totally in love with right now. Had these kind of dark purple um, cells pop up through here. I love the colors and the layout. I love this white line that goes through there. And neither of these are varnished or anything, guys. So um, they're a little matte right now, but then I will seal them and the colors will pop again. So there you guys go. All right. I'm glad I got to add this to the end of the video there. So once again, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next time.